So I was scrolling through this Instagram feed. Uh, when I clicked on search button on Instagram, I found something new. Uh, I was trying to follow some hashtags and I found that the complete explore page is now different. <laughs> Earlier what used to happen is there were nine top posts and then most recent ones but now there are two tabs on the top which is like most recent and uh, the top posts. Now this is a latest update and that is what I'm going to be talking about. I'm going to go into my mobile and just show you what is the difference and how it can impact uh, the business. So I don't know I'm just viewing this so let's dive into that. All right, so as you can see, I'm right now on my Instagram profile and I'm going to be tapping into search box and uh, over here, I have all these feed, but try to just search for something. Let's say I click on search, I click on tags and I search for, let's say, um, I search for calisthenics, right? And I tap on, let's say, calisthenic movements. Now, look at this. This feed has completely changed. This feed for hashtag uh, explore page or search page, whatever you want to call it, is completely changed. Now what you can do is you can actually see how many number of posts has been posted uh, for this particular hashtag, which is right now over here. As you can see on the top, it is mentioned 178k, 178k uh, posts. And am I following this hashtag or not? I am already following. But if you are not following, then there would be a follow button. So let's say I go into any other, uh, let's say this uh, calisthenics Canada, all right? And uh, all right, so I'm following that hashtag as well. Let's go down, go down, go down. And let's say calisthenics parks. So there you go. So now for this hashtag, I'm not following this uh, feed. So I'm not following any particular post which has calisthenics parks. So now if I tap on follow, so let's say I tap on follow, I'm now following and there are 3,630 3, posts. And you can see related uh, hashtags with respect to calisthenics parks, which we have just searched for. And as you can see earlier, what used to happen was there was uh, most, I mean top posts where there were nine top posts. All right, and then there used to be the most recent post, but now they have changed the algorithm where they have top and recent on the top itself. All right, top and recent on the top itself. So if I am tapping on top, I am seeing all the top posts. Now, how it has been uh, uh, driven over here, uh, that is still unknown to me. Now, there might be some articles, so I'm going to definitely go into that. But just as just I have seen and I wanted to quickly share with you in this episode, uh, and uh, I, I don't know when this uh, update was rolled in. Then uh, when we click on recent, these are the recent posts. Like if you refresh, probably if somebody is refreshing and posting with this hashtag, which is calisthenic park, that would be on the top over here, right? So that was a quick little update uh, for this feed. And also you can send, uh, just, just uh, see on the top right corner, you have that arrow send message button. Uh, besides that hashtag so if I tap on that I can actually uh, send it th send this complete feed to somebody all right from my follower or following so I hope you like this update and I hope uh, that if you are not aware about that you will like it and let's see how it can help uh, I'll, I'll do some episodes in future if I get something to know and some benefits out of it I'll just document as I keep on doing in my blog episode series and I look forward to see you tomorrow. Till then, take care, bye-bye. And as always, guys, stay awesome, God bless, and subscribe.